today I'm at Northgate. Uh, I wasn't gonna do a video, but I walked in and I realized I haven't been here in months. And as soon as I walked in, I was like, oh man, this is too good not to film. Um, I've already picked up a couple things in my basket. I'm going back and forth. I've got the total craze. I'm ready to shop. Let's go. Of course, this is uh, the second one. I have never seen one quite like this. $7, that is an insanely good deal. This is coming with me. Yeah, I mean, I've seen the anthropomorphic bugs, but a little flower petal ballerina one, come on. Now, I really, of course, uh, now I usually pick these guys up. They sell for like 38, Ooh. but $40. 20%, uh, 50%. I think I'm gonna leave it just because I've had it a bunch and there's so many unique ones. This little flower girl here is 32 and has the umbrella. Might get that. This guy for $4.50. I'm pretty obligated to pick this up. Anything fuzzy ceramic. This one, super cute little dog figurine. It's only four bucks, so I'm gonna go ahead and get it. And then the little Norcrest, or it looks left in, excuse, no, not go. Gosh, I'm goofy. It's got a little damage to its whisker, but it's only six dollars. So let's add another 10 to our bill, huh? Let's see what else we got. This one's only four dollars. This guy's pretty different, $4.50. And then got this deer vase. What? Seven bucks sold. Don't worry, I'm not done in there. But these caught my eye, $6. It's got a little bit of damage, a little chipped ear. So cute. Oh my gosh, I'm totally nuts right now. So 450. I kind of wish that was a pair. I'm a little overwhelmed. This is this is uh getting me. They're missing their whiskers. They got some damage. What about these guys? Oh stop. How are these only seven dollars? They've got some paint loss, but it's a great set. Now I need to get in the bottom of this case. These two little yellow poodles. Oh my gosh, how cute. For five bucks, I'm gonna grab them. And of course, a red bow tie lamb for $7. That's a huge deal. Oh, this is so cute too. This one usually sells pretty well, even though this can be a hard sell. And then of course the little reindeer only two dollars and fifty cents gosh i um think i need to get more cash out little bunny bank seven bucks so cute wait they've got the toy cases oh dang it i think i'm gonna go ahead and get this too yeah i'm gonna need to take a break and get more cash all right, I'm back. I went to the ATM. So far, my bill is at $220. I don't want to spend too much more, but I'm not done. The first thing that I got to do is grab these girls with the parasol. Yeah, this is just too cute. I got the little parasol here. I'm going to investigate just to make sure it's not broken before I buy this. Oh my gosh, there's more back there. Ah! Yeah, this is just too adorable. Uh, it's got a little nick right here, but all in all, it's in pretty good condition. Now, how much were these cats? I know they've got some damage. They're only $7. Oh, am I being weird for leaving them? I'm trying to be kind of picky. I do like these owls. 
wish that one wasn't chipped. Now, I've had these a few times, um, both of them. They sell for good money. I think they sold for like $68, $69 each. This one's 20, so 10 after the discount. And then this one's 24, oh my gosh, how cute. Yeah, Margaret Holbrook, it's a really cute illustrator. Um, I think I am gonna go ahead and grab both of these just because after the discount it comes to 22. Uh, I'm not gonna sell them for as much as they sold my last ones just because I kind of feel like I've already had it so it's not as surprising. Um, but I mean, come on, how adorable. I've got a little bit of wear, but uh, all in all, it's definitely worth more than uh, 12 and 10 bucks. I'm also just now seeing uh, this ponytail tin dish set. It's got some damage, a little rust, but six bucks. Um, I think I sold like one of these trays alone for 10 bucks. I'm gonna go ahead and get this. Like I said, I wish I could just buy everything, but unfortunately, I do have to take into account that I'm spending my own money to do this. Um, you know, it's stressful. If no one <laughs> buys anything, then I've just kind of spent my money. Oh, but these mushrooms. It's got a little damage. Oh, should I get them? I should get them. They're pretty great. So now I'm officially at $277. What is this? How adorable. Ah! All right, well, 30% off $8. I'm gonna grab this for sure. What's this bank? Oh, it's so funny. Ah, it's just got a little bit of a chip. It's a good price still. Um, those usually sell for decent money. I can't remember the maker. I'm having a moment. I have it on. I have it in my uh, brain somewhere. I think it's just stashed away because I'm totally overstimulated. Right? What is in this box? I'm gonna have to climb over there and find out what that is. Little blue teddy bear. Cute. Eight dollars and fifty percent off, and then. $8.50 and 50% off, $4.25, that's a yes. All right, let's keep going. Uh, this recipe box is pretty freaking neat. It's in like perfect condition. Does it say Jay Chen? Oh, wow. For $8 and 30% off, I'm definitely gonna grab this. I didn't realize uh, he made recipe boxes too. I thought it was just toys. Well, there you go. I learned something new today. This is what I was originally coming I know. <laughs> I just saw how much stuff I was buying. Okay, now what is happening here? Whoa. That is really, really different. All right, so I just asked if they would count as dolls because there's 50% off dolls, and we kind of agreed they would, so... I feel like I kind of have to get these because they're so freaking strange. How does, uh, how does he look? <laughs> yeah, I need to get this. Now, there's one last thing down here. It's this. I'm not sure about this. There's styrofoam. This is perhaps one of the coolest things I've found. I think I need to do that. Whoa, wait. Remember that time I took a break to go to the ATM and then didn't get enough? Okay, so I've just done the math. And I have $330, and so far my bill is at $329.85. Does it work? It doesn't work. Okay, so we can put that back. So we can deduct that. 
but I'm going to go ahead and get these puppets. And I'm a little nervous about this. I think I'm going to do it. They're really unique. I don't think they're bunnies. I think they're cats. They're going to be a pain in the butt to ship. I'm going to have to charge more than I'd like to, honestly, just because they're so unique and they're so fragile and I'd have to ship them separately from most other things. But then as soon as I picked them up, I found this little music, this little jewelry box. It's got pink lining. That is too cute. $8. I'm going to grab that. Gosh, this is too much for me. I'm out of control. Oh my God. All right, so I've spent almost my entire budget. This is the last booth I'm gonna take a look at before I check out. I'm really hoping I don't find anything else. 30%, no, please stop. Gosh, look at this ice cream bank. It's really heavy, it's solid. I'm kind of shopped out, honestly. The good news is I'm not crazy far from where I live. So I can always come back. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna call it a day. This is enough for me. Got three and a half, four boxes at least full. Everyone was super nice, helped me carry stuff out. I spent $320 exactly. So I really wasn't anticipating doing that today. Uh, I got my work cut out ahead for me. I got a lot of listings. I got to unload the car. Um, so I was going to keep going, but I'm checking out. I'm done. I'm going home. So I made it back home. I got the car completely unpacked. And I'm going to take a break for the rest of the day. But tomorrow, I am going to do an unboxing and kind of like a pricing explain video. Um, I haven't done that before, but... My last unboxing, people seem to really like it. So if you're sick of seeing this stuff, sorry. Don't tune in tomorrow because you're just gonna see it again. But uh, I think it will be fun to try something different. In the meantime, I hope everybody has a good night and see you tomorrow morning, bye.